YouTube, what is going on guys? It is your boy Chico Bob bringing you guys a brand new video and before we get started with today's video Like always if you guys are new to the channel or you guys have not yet subscribed Feel free to hit that button down below. It really does help me out. I really do appreciate everyone that does stop by and subscribes and And whatnot, you know, basically if you just stop by the channel, I really do appreciate it Also, if you guys want to leave a like on the video It really does help me out and it helps my channel Kind of, I would say blow up. I mean it would get more attraction so eventually that could lead to blowing up and then we'd be famous and then we'd have a lot of viewers I'm just kidding, but yeah leave a like on the video if you guys want to and let's hop right into today's rebuild so we're gonna be doing the Houston Rockets rebuild as There's been a lot of changes with the team. You know, the uh, head coach has been fired and uh, Daryl Morey, I think was the uh, uh, GM he got fired or he left. I don't remember what happened and then Russell Westbrook wants out uh, James Harden's on the trading block or something like that. So we have a lot of things going around the league and we're going to make some trades and see what we can do, help them out and whatnot. Also, as you guys can see, I'm still on the PS, not the PS, we're on the place, I mean the PC and we have not yet got the PS4 or 5 because everything was sold out and I missed every single thing. So here we go. Also, uh, I've been playing a lot of Call of Duty lately, so that's why the schedule is kind of whack. But I'll get that fixed. I'll, I got that sorted out. So here we go. We're going to go check what we can get for Russell Westbrook from the Boston Celtics. Nothing available. Buddy here. Vucevic. Kristaps Porzingis from the Mavericks. I mean, we can get a center alongside James Harden. Not a bad trade offer there. Toronto Raptors. We get Sergi Baca and we get Pascal. I'm fine with that. Uh, Devin Booker. Ricky Rubio. I don't see Russell Westbrook going to the Thunder. I mean, the Phoenix Suns. But definitely a possibility, but I don't see it happening. Um, I don't really want to create my own trade offer here, but the one that I like the most, really, like realistically speaking, from this is the Sergi Baca Pascal trade. I also saw a trade offer involving where? Where is it? Uh, we go to the Clippers. Oh my God! I, I went all over the place. We go to the Clippers. We go Paul George for Russell Westbrook. I've, I've seen this trade. Straight up, I, I saw this one, and I'm, I'm I would see like I'd be really interested to see how this works. But uh, I'm gonna go out there and actually do this trade offer uh, for Pascal and Sergi Bakum. I, I just want to see how it really plays out. It's a little different storyline because obviously it's not fantasy. Uh, I mean, this is a fantasy draft, not realistic because we have no idea who's gonna be traded for who, right? We don't know if Russell Westbrook's actually gonna leave. We don't know if James Harden's gonna leave. We don't know who what's gonna happen. So yeah. Uh, let's go see what we else we, what else we can go trade for. So now we got this big three-headed, you know, contracted monster. So we really can't. Is James Harden on the char chopping block? Oh, nothing crazy there. So Eric Gordon, and maybe you can toss in a, uh, another guy. Nah, Eric Gordon himself. Can you give me a small four that we'd like? But a heal, not a small four, but definitely we can manage to move him there. Is there any small forward out here that we do? Oof, nothing out there. Maybe attach him with Robert Covington since his contract situation is a little bit bigger. Maybe we can finesse some league. I see Derrick Rose, but that's not going to help me out. I'm going to see if we can make uh, Eric Gordon doesn't go up either way. Robert Covington goes to an 84. PJ Tucker moving back to like a small forward. He goes up. All right. Yeah, I totally forgot he was at the center position. So I don't really condone that. I'm just kidding. I have no idea what I'm saying right now. All right. So Eric Gordon, PJ Tucker. We can get Buddy Heald. I feel like Buddy Heald is the best option here. Or Will Barton, Mason Plumley. Will Barton Mason Plumley will help because we don't need scoring out of Will Barton. We'll get more defensive. Uh, Plumley can come off our bench to be that center. Uh, Eric Gordon's basically the Will Barton, but Will Barton is slightly better. I kind of don't want to give up this pick. I don't. I, I don't really see us. I mean, I don't really know why we wouldn't give it up. I mean, we have decent. I mean, we have a decent amount of picks left, so I, I'll I'll do that trade for that pick. You know why not? So now we got a starting lineup of. Oh, we need a point guard. Okay. Uh, maybe Plumlee isn't safe. So Plumlee and Robert Covington in the first. All right. So we'll toss in this first because we should be decent. I'm looking for a point guard that I can trust. That could run for Derrick Rose. I mean, I trust Derrick Rose. I mean, I don't say why I don't see. I mean, don't trust him. Do I? Hmm. Okay. There'll be no defense back court wise. We can get Clint Capella or we can get this first. Uh, we already have a center. We can move him to the power forward spot. Uh, not a bad option there. Buddy here, Rashawn Holmes, Derrick Rose. Uh, can I do this Derrick Rose trade without giving up much? I'd have to make up. Uh, he's making 14. So, okay. So, he's making seven. I can manage seven, right? Uh, I'll give you guys Robert Covington. Oh. 
Cool. We got a starting point guard in Derrick Rose. So starting lineup, we got Derrick Rose, James Harden, Will Barton, Pascal Serge. Off the bench, we got Mason Plumlee, uh, Daniel House, Austin Rivers. Not a bad team. We definitely can upgrade it in like a few spots. So like Mason Plumlee definitely can get upgraded alongside Daniel House in our first. Uh, I don't think we even tossed in our first. So Jason Richardson, Tristan Thompson, Zubak, and Patrick Beverly. Not a bad pickup right there. Cody Zeller and Vontae, not a bad pickup right there. Bogdanovich, Nemanja Bielica, we can stretch the floor a little bit off the bench. Uh, Tim Hardaway, Willie Colley Stein. Eric Gordon and Jeremy Grant. They both can come back. I mean, they both can come on the team. Oh, that's not a bad trade, actually. That's that's a really solid pickup. I think I'm going to do that trade. I, I know we just got rid of them, but Eric Gordon is going to be a good defender off the bench. And then we also have Jeremy Grant, who's going to be pretty solid. So now we can go find that point guard that we've been missing. So Austin Rivers, Ben McLemore, and a fur. Oh, we don't really have a fur. So like, just a solid point guard. Even even Austin Rivers isn't that bad. So I'll, I mean, I'm fine with Austin Rivers being our point guard. He's pretty solid time to time. So what do we need? What do we need? Uh, we need actually a center, right? So like Ben McLemore and Chris Clemens can be traded for a center. Uh, let's go see what we can get out there, right? Uh, ben McLemore, David Nwaba in a second. I just need a solid center, nothing crazy. Bruno Fernando, Duncan Robinson's out here. Wow. Oof. I feel like I shouldn't pass up on that, but I probably will have to, right? You don't have Haslam. Maybe I don't. Maybe we, are, we don't have a guard, right? Yeah. Okay, that's fine. We can make it a nine-man. We can make it a nine-man rotation. Uh... We could possibly try. Oh my god, we still have so many forwards on this team. It's actually ridiculous. Uh, we'll just go sign a center. I mean, we'll go find a center that's that can just run the center position minutes, you know, if they need it. So, like, Jordan Bell, welcome to the team. So, we'll make a 10 minute lineup with Jordan Bell getting those minutes. I don't hate it. We have a lot of players on this team. Uh, now we got Steven. Oh, yeah, because they don't really know who the actual coach is going to be. And I don't hate I don't hate the system we run here. Premier centric. I think we're going to be fine this season. I don't really see us making many trades like in the next few years. So I'm going to simulate this first season with James Harden and the rest of the crew. We basically traded everyone away except James Harden. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have wrapped up this season with only 48 wins. Luka wins your MVP, a triple-double machine. Um, honestly, I'm not mad about the way we finished the season. Then we just went on a lot of L's back and forth. James Harden averaged 26, 6, and 8. Uh, great numbers from him. Anyone else here? No, we did not. Okay, so we're the fourth seed. I don't really care what happens as long as we win. Uh, player stats, James Harden, Les Pascal, Derrick Rose. Eric Gordon wasn't bad. Surge. Okay, maybe. Oh, maybe Eric Gordon isn't as bad as I thought he was. But for the paycheck he's getting, it's not the greatest, right? So we're going to have to see if we can move him next season. So wherever we go, uh, Portland, they got Dame, CJ, Mello. Oh, same team. Forgot. Uh, no changes really were made. Game one goes to Portland. We are the better seed. Uh, so we more than likely should win, but it is what it is, right? I, I can't really control it as we went forward to it. Lakers. Uh, once again, we meet up in the conference final. I mean, the semifinals against LeBron, Anthony Davis, Dwight. All right. Good team. Good team. Fantastic team. As we take game one, they take game two. Uh, they take game three. Come on. Uh, we just got to take one more. Come on. Come on. Tie it up. 3-1 three, three, in their favor. I don't really know why we're not we're struggling so hard. We have a really well-rounded team, so I guess it's LeBron and AD just carrying them. And as we get eliminated, LeBron led them, Kuzma led them, and James Harden. All right. There it goes. Year number one, the Kimball Walker goes on to win a championship. Draft lottery, we don't really have anyone. So let's go to the NBA draft. Uh, I, I literally said we didn't have anything, and then I just go there anyways. All right. Rookie signings, we didn't have anything. Team player option, Will Barton accepts. Uh, Duncan Robinson, I'll give you this qualifying offer. Now we have to go sign some players. Oh, because we lose Serge Ibaka, Jeremy Grant, and Austin Rivers. How much money we got? $23 million. All right, nothing, nothing crazy. So I'm going to go back out in there and sign exactly everyone that we brought first. Uh, I think they'll be pretty solid role players. If not, we can definitely just trade them away in general. So uh, let's make sure we get everyone and make sure that the players that we want to keep aren't on the chopping block. All right, there we go. Uh, now we got, hmm, we got a few offers left. Uh, we need a backup point guard. Oh, we need a point guard in general. Okay. I'm going to see what we can get for Ibaka here. He, he was, he's a pretty good guy. Like, he's pretty solid. But the way he's been playing, 
Uh, I need a little bit more out of you, right? So let's see what we can get for him. Uh, Serge has decent trade value, actually. He's actually fantastic trade value. We can get Karis LeVert, Gogo Badazzi, Dejounte Murray wouldn't be bad. Yusuf Nurkic. Okay, so really nothing out here. Hmm. Is maybe we can make a trade? To, is Drummond taken? Is Drummond still in the free agency period? No, he's not. But Anthony Davis is still here. Okay, so let's go see if we can go get Drummond. I'm not really sure what team he plays for, but I feel like we can definitely make a trade for him. And you know in 2K, he's pretty solid. I mean, he's a fantastic defender. He's a fantastic offensive play. I mean, he's working on his three-point shot. I think he'll be good for the squad if we can pick him up. So, Serge, we need to make up eight more million. All right, I got you. I'll give you guys Jeremy Grant, as Jeremy Grant wasn't that great. Uh, I'll give you guys a first. Okay, so that's... Okay, okay, okay. I see you. I, I see you guys. What if I give you guys Will Barton? Oh, there we go. I kind of I didn't mean to throw Will Barton into that trade. I meant to throw someone else. But Will Barton works. So then Eric Gordon needs to... I mean, he can be fine, but I, I, I need someone. I need... Hmm. I need more trustworthy people starting. I mean, he's not bad, actually. He, he can give me buckets. All right, let's go fill out the roster real quick. Uh, we need a backup point guard so we can get Michael Carter-Williams. Uh, shooting guards, we can get him. Uh, Mark Keith Morris. And then center position, we'll get Emmons. Oh, okay. We can't sign Wesley. Uh, I'll sign QC. Uh, Damian Lee. And then Bobby. All right, cool. That should realistically wrap up our rotation i don't really see anyone else we want to pick up so let's go to the beginning of the season i kind of like the team the way it's going on right now uh i think we've done better uh than the last season i'm not really sure how that was such a bad season but it is what it is right so we're gonna make a 10-man rotation once again eric gordon dips super hard uh which kind of sucks him and jeremy grant oh it's gonna be interesting to see what we can get for this right this value is a kind of garbage but we, we can still try, right? Uh, so, Alec Burks, Gary Harris, Kale Bridges, Ricky Rubio. Only good trade I really saw here was Larry Nance and Jeremy Grant. Uh, I'm going to do this trade. Will Barton would come. We'll bring it right back. He'll be pretty solid for us. Mark Keefe can make him a small forward. I'll try to trade you away. I try to trade a lot of these guys away because, I mean, even though they're good players, we need a little bit more. So, Mark Keefe and Larry Nance together. Can we get a better power forward or center? Brooke Lopez is not bad at all. Clint Capella ain't bad. I mean, what, bring him right back. I mean, they, were, they weren't, like, they don't need a center, but we've, we've been centerless for a long time. So we'll bring him to the team. We don't really have a point guard at the moment, so we're going to go find a point guard. doesn't have to be any crazy point guard. It just has to be good enough, right? Or decent. It has to be a decent point guard who can work alongside James Harden, right? So uh, Aaron Holiday? Sure, I, I I could care less. That's not my I goal really to have a quality. I mean, I feel like I'd rather have a quality center and a, a better fit around side him like Pascal. I'd rather have him than a quality center. So now we just need to go fill out the rotation off the bench. So Kenny, Bobby, and then the second. Just just fill it out. Just role players need to be here. Grayson Allen. I don't know how he didn't get a single minute while he was playing for his team, but wow, there's like not a single trade offer here. Ben McLemore, I'll pick you up. Welcome back. Uh, wow, we, we're we really scuffed on money situation, huh? Okay. Uh, Daniel Gafford, no taco fall. I can bring taco, right? Can be a good power forward for us if need be. Shabazz is available. Okay, taco fall, welcome to the team. I'm going to make you a power forward. Even though you're like going to be the tallest power forward out there, you're going to be that power forward for the squad. Starting lineup, I like. Bench? I don't like. I just need like a point guard. Is there a point guard? Oh, oh, Isaiah Thomas, welcome to the team. I think we're good. Now we're good, right? Now we're good. We're gonna make it a nine-man rotation with Isaiah Thomas getting those minutes. I like it. Is it better than last year? Probably not. I'm gonna make sure uh, James Harden is the number one option for the squad. I think that should help us out a little bit more. Uh, is there anything natural tempo? Crash the glass, sure. I'm gonna simulate this next season. We're going to win a championship for sure. All right, ladies and gentlemen, year number two has wrapped up. We finished with 63 wins. Luka wins your MVP once again. LaMelo Ball, rookie of the year. Brandon Clark, most six man. And then Jonathan Isaac, DPOI, most improved jaw. And then Stefan 
Steven, whatever you want to call him, is our coach of the year. So we did have James Harden as a number one option, averaging 31, 4, and 9. Great numbers from him. Fantastic. And then, oh, Kawhi, he was uh, he was on the Raptors, not the Rockets. My mistake. Uh, then we also had Drummond, averaging eight, 17 and 14. Fantastic numbers by him. I knew exactly what kind of numbers I was going to get from him if I did pick him up for the squad. So player stats, here we go. Pascal even averaged, went up in numbers. Uh, Drummond and Aaron Holiday was our third scoring, fourth scoring option, and Will Barton Taco. Yes, sir, Taco. Yes, sir. His shot time is in 82. He averaged 11 points for us. How many games do you play in? It must have been a lot, right? Uh, games played, does it tell you? Game started. He played every single game. Wow, that's fantastic. Click Capella, 9 and 10. Isaiah Thomas and the Men Macklemore. Fantastic season by all of our guys. All right, first round against my uh, Minnesota. Cat, D'Angelo Russell, Michael Porter. I don't know who's the shooting guard is, but he is he really going to be able to... Oh, my God, 2K. Jared Culver is having a breakout game against us. I don't think so. I don't think so. Omari Spellman's having a breakout game against us. You, mm, you can't even make this up. James Harden still like tacos are second scoring option Pascal five for 20 you, you suck you suck all right so we we won the first game yeah by one we won the second game we lost the third game we lost the fourth game we lost the fifth game then we lost the sixth oh my god we actually deserve to lose you know what I I, I came they're gonna do it aren't they the Lamelo ball team I this is a meme team you know what at the end of the day, who can complain, right? We, we were the first seed. We were, what? How, how many wins were we ahead of each other? 12 wins ahead in the Western Conference. We were ahead in the Eastern Conference by two games. What can we say? And they didn't even make it out. Like, they lost in the Conference Final. 2K, I just need to go to the next gen. I know next gen is much better for the simulation stuff. So, hopefully I can get that in my hands on the PS5 very soon. But if you guys did enjoy this video, let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you guys want to see next. And I'll see you guys later. Peace out, guys.